My name is Remy Chukunyane. Um, I am the executive director of Ugumba Center for Leadership Development in Africa, an organization that uh, was uh, established to uh, provide young people with the leadership and enterprise development skills that they need you know, to be able to compete with others at the global stage. And uh, yeah, here we are uh, in Abuja to implement one of our signature projects that we call the Goomba Enterprise Challenge. You know, the previous one we had, the first edition was in Nowhere Imo State, and that was a fantastic one. You know, from the feedback that we got after the project, it was really fantastic. And some people that won the prizes, they received their checks, and they are doing very well in their various businesses. When you empower young people to create jobs for themselves, you end up uh, reducing the unemployment crisis in the country. So that's why we, we, this project is so dear to us, it's so dear to our president and the board of trustees, because it has to do with job creation. You know the rate of uh, unemployment in the country, the statistics is uh, really uh, alarming. And so that is worrisome to us. And that's why we, we are passionate about what we are doing. This enterprise challenge is an idea pitching and grant competition where young people with different ideas in different sectors of the economy, they come to compete for our grants, our startup grants. Now the reason we set up these startup grants is because uh, we have engaged young people a number of times and they keep talking about lack of funding, we don't have money to do this. I can do that, I can do that, but I don't have money to do it. You know, so we saw that as a basic challenge. And that's also why we are focusing on enterprise challenge. You know, so many people need money, but how do you select who to give? So we put them through this challenge. If you win, if you have the best idea, we will not give you money. So, so that's why we are doing uh, enterprise challenge. And again, we have also observed that when pe people convert prizes more than, more than gifts, you know, so uh, someone after going through the whole process and wins the prize, he converts it, he loves, he, he tends uh, to love it so much. And what that means is that he's not going to joke with the fund. You know, so these are the observations that we made and uh, they are really working out, especially from the feedback that we got from the last edition. You know, again, I, I would not also fail to say that when you subject young people into creative activities and critical thinking, you find out that they will come out with the best ideas in the world. But when you just leave them to go running about looking for a job, they keep running about, they don't get anything. But when you put them together and say, look, give them the basic things that they need, they come up with wonderful ideas. And then I don't want you to lose sight of the fact that ideas are just like raw materials. They don't look beautiful until you refine them. So we ask any young person, come up with whichever ideas that you have. We'll help you refine them and then give you the resources that you need you know, to, to push them forward and it becomes something that can be celebrated. So that's what we're doing. Well, we have the last edition of the Enterprise Challenge in Imo State. Over 200 young people applied to participate. Uh, we put them under what we call a boot camp, where they were trained in uh, business development skills, and also uh, they also learned how to pitch because this is an idea pitching competition. And so they passed through those uh, uh, courses, and after that, 10 finalists, the, the persons that, that had the best ideas, 10 of them were uh, selected for the final competition. And at the final competition, the star prize winners emerged. And there we gave out prizes ranging from 500,000 Naira for the first prize, the second prize 300,000, the third prize 200,000, and consolation prizes for the fourth to tenth uh, uh, positions. So we want to replicate that here in Abuja. And this one is a national event, and it's open for any young person across the country no matter your tribe, whether you are Igbo, Yoruba, Hausa, TV, or whatever it is, even Ijo, you are allowed to contest for this one. And we are doing it because we believe that uh, we have a role to play, you know, uh, to reduce the unemployment crisis that is ravaging the youth 
population in this country and beyond. So just like I have earlier talked about the first event that took place in Owerri. So we are in Abuja for the national event. The next one will be for the African continent. So we are graduating from the, the local to the national, then we're going Pan-African. You know, so like I said, that is our own contribution. And uh, by the grace of God, uh, our founder, uh, the president, Wumba Uchungosu, uh, is a man that is so passionate about young people and uh, you know, empowering them. So this is an opportunity for him to really advance what he started a long time ago. Uh, you know, so want to uh, advance this so that we can achieve more and make more impact in the lives of young people and also contribute to a better country. Okay, very good. Yeah, you, you know, we cannot uh, reach everyone. So we started to uh, uh, streamline it and it is for those between 18 and 30 years of age. Now, why we are looking at this class is because uh, they are the ones, either um, young graduates or and, uh, undergraduates. Yeah, so, and uh, it is a good uh, population that we are targeting because uh, some of them are fresh graduates, so, and they are running about looking for jobs. Now, for us, we don't believe in uh, young people, in job seeking, young people running about looking for jobs. For us, we are promoting job creation because we believe that young people have got a lot that can be turned into business uh, ventures. So why do you go about looking for jobs? Our Nigerian youths are highly endowed. So the problem is the capacity to turn those uh, skills and passions into business opportunities, business ventures. So that's what we're trying to do. We don't want them to graduate and, run and go looking for jobs. After all, how much do you get paid when you, get, when you go into a job? But if you can turn your idea or turn your skill or talent into a business venture, you make more money. Uh, other people we celebrate across the world today, they are not in paid jobs, they are not in paid employments. They founded their own uh, businesses and they employed other people and they're making a lot of money. We're celebrating them as the uh, richest persons in the world. So that's what we're preaching. We want more people to go into job pressure. And that's the only way to solve the unemployment crisis in the country. Okay, very good. Um, yeah, um, just like we kept uh, telling the people of Nigeria, um, the application has opened and uh, it started on the 1st of August. The applications will close on the 16th. Then the boot camp will commence on the 19th and close on the 23rd of August. Then why the main event is on the 30th. And uh, they, they, it will end with a, a, a walk for tanks, a walk of tanks, JS walk on the 31st. You know, so, um, yeah, uh, just like I said, we, it's an idea pitching competition, an idea pitching competition. Anyone that applies will be admitted into the boot camp because we don't know who, 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 who will be the winner, who will have the idea that will become the next big thing in the country. So that's why we allow everyone that applies, you know, to participate so that from there uh, we'll be able to select the best ideas and then begin to empower them. You know, the first prize for this edition is 1 million naira, the second prize is 700,000, the third one is 500,000. So, yeah, it's something that we're interested in. We want to know who will win the star prize. We want to celebrate the person because they will pass through a number of hurdles. And uh, for me, like I said, wherever I go, if someone that has an idea can pass through all the challenges that, that we, we place them, we, 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 we put them through, it means he or she is ready to run with the idea and to also utilize the money that we are going to give. You cannot, after, through, after uh, putting up your application, you go through a boot camp, you do a preliminary pitch, you also come for the final competition. It means you are very serious, you are going to use the money. So that's, uh, that, that's uh, the justification we have for this model. The venue is uh, at Abuja International Conference Centre. That's where the venue will be, the final comp pitching competition. Now, it will also, you also feature a number of keynote presentations that will look at uh, uh, the role of entrepreneurship in uh, job creation or in, in solving the unemployment uh, crisis in the country. 
then, uh, uh, yeah, and then also access to finance opportunities. You know, we have also found out uh, that most young people or most businesses crumble because they don't have access to finance, maybe to sustain them or to scale up what they have already started doing. You know, so we are also providing access to finance opportunities. And that is also why we are bringing other finance inst uh, institutions like CBN, Bank of Industry, uh, Smithan and others, you know, to also part even venture capital firms to participate in the, uh, in the event so that even those that don't win our grants, they can also have access to other funding support that are available. They must win our own grants. So everyone that comes is a winner and that is also why we are bringing all those stakeholders, you know, to share with the audience and the participants the opportunities that they have for them. You know, like last time in Owere, we featured some federal government agencies and also promoting the ease of doing business uh, policy of the federal government. So all of them are geared towards empowering these young people with, with ideas and uh, uh, resources that they need, you know, to move, to, to turn their ideas into business uh, ventures. So that's what we're doing. And we are going to also replicate it here in a bigger way because we're in Abuja. Yeah, certainly, certainly. Yeah, anyone that applies to participate, whether you win or not, you become a fellow of uh, Ugumba Leadership Center. And uh, uh, even our president, you know, volunteers to mentor uh, the, our members, our fellows. You know, so it doesn't stop there. And again, um, just like I, I met with uh, Smidan Management this afternoon, they have also agreed to uh, mentor and uh, yeah, mentor and provide other technical support to. The, the our fellows the same applies to Abuja Enterprise Agency they have also agreed to uh, uh, continue to provide support to the winners and the other participants in this uh, challenge so it is a whole lot of opportunities that we are bringing so anyone anywhere that applies automatically becomes a fellow of Ogumba Leadership Center and will begin to benefit from all the services that we are providing you must not win the money. Now, there's something remarkable that I want to share with the audience. Um, the feedback we got from the last edition, you know, where it says that some people said, oh, what they benefited from the training is even worth more than the money they got that they, that they didn't get. Are you getting it? Yeah, some people said, oh, what I learned, uh, they are the things they, they spend thousands of naira to learn in uh, uh, Lagos Business School, but I got them here for free. Are you getting it? So. The training, the, the skills, the, the capacity that they get is worth more than the money we are giving to them. For those of them that understand why they are coming for the competition. Some people just want to come and collect money. But those that know what we are doing, they take it serious from the beginning to the end and they get more empowered because they, get, uh, they, they acquire new skills, they get new information and possibly get some money to, to go home with and to continue their businesses. So a whole lot of benefits. Thank you.